everyone, this is Katie and this is my life with beds or vascular Ehlers-Danlos Syndrome. Today I'm going to provide a quick update on how I'm doing since my spleen ruptured last month. But before I go into this video, if you haven't already subscribed to this channel, I would really appreciate it if you did. On this channel I talk about my story with beds, I provide like community updates sometimes when there's relevant things going on, and then I also share pieces of my podcast staying connected where I talk to other people about their stories with beds. So go ahead and hit that subscribe button, turn on the notification bell and hit like on this video if you like it. In a nutshell, last month my spleen ruptured spontaneously and in order to stop the bleeding from the spleen they actually coiled my splenic artery which feeds the spleen and the thought there was that it would cut off the major blood supply to the spleen and part of the spleen would die, the part that was bleeding and that wouldn't have blood supply anymore and that part of my spleen would survive with collateral blood vessels or like alternate routes of blood flow to the spleen. Last week I had a scan and kind of like a month out of the hospital um, appointment and follow up and found out that my entire spleen survived. So my spleen is alive and I am doing well. Recovery is going good. I was kind of surprised that the spleen survived and I, I really wasn't expecting that. I'm still getting some periodic like spleen pain. I don't know how else to describe it. Like sometimes it just kind of hurts right there and it comes on really kind of suddenly but it's a lot more dull than it was of course when it ruptured and it's not too alarming. It just kind of takes me by surprise. It lasts a few minutes. It goes away. I can't figure out what brings that on, if anything, or if that's just still part of that healing process. But there was nothing on my scan that was concerning. Everything looked good. The spleen's alive. The blood is being like reabsorbed into my system and I am doing well. I'm really excited that my spleen survived. I keep joking with people like, it's alive! Like my spleen is alive and that is just a really cool feeling to know that that organ survived in its entirety when I really didn't expect it to after such a traumatic event. So thank you everybody for your support during that event. Um, I got such wonderful notes from people and just all the love and support was incredible and I really appreciate it and I really appreciate you. Thank you all for watching. I hope you all are doing well and I will talk to you soon. Bye.